If you clicked on this video, I'm assuming that you are going to join college this year. Some of you might be very happy and you must be looking forward to meeting new people. While there are also some people who are scared and anxious and they're like, uh, how am I even going to talk and meet new people? So I'll be joining third year in a couple of days and I've been in your shoes when I was just starting off with college and I understand what uh, things you might be feeling and what emotions you might be going through. In this video, I'll be sharing with you four important things that I learned from two years of experience in college. These four important points, if you remember it throughout your college life and um, like even if you remember it throughout your life, it's going to benefit you a lot. If you're new around here, my name is Dhruv Pai Angle and I'm a junior at Bits Kilani Goa campus. I would request you to get a pen and a paper or maybe some place where you can take notes i'll wait for you to get a pen and a paper don't worry okay first point is that there is no hurry a lot of times our generation is used to getting things fast uh, and this is also portrayed by so many content creators i made x amount at y age or i went to prom with the most popular girl in my college might sound intimidating but you have to remember that you can't compare them with yourself prefer living life at your own pace and your own laws but that doesn't mean you go and break some national law that's just bad maybe the second point is that build trust and relations sometimes it gets very lonely in college especially if you're living away from home or when you're living in pg or when you're living in your uh, campus hostel life gets difficult when you're alone so try to go out there try to make friends try to get to know people try to understand them now you can be friends with seniors as well as juniors or uh, anyone whom you are comfortable with it doesn't matter what their age is or you know what uh, they're doing what just matters is that if you are comfortable in talking and sharing with them and if they're motivating you to do better in life it also gives you a motivation to get out of bed to uh, go to class to uh, go eat food to drink to maybe go to the gym together and a lot of things you just feel motivated and you get a reason to uh, come out of bed which you wouldn't if you were alone and you did not have the motivation to there's a difference between being nice and being kind being nice means you never say no to people don't don't be nice it's okay if you're not nice but always be kind be there for people and be kind don't do it for your benefit or because you're going to gain something from that person but rather do it because you genuinely care for the person the third point is that it's okay for everyone to not like you unlike in school people are more expressive in college maybe because they are more mature and because uh, now they have more opinions about life now you have to understand that not everyone is going to like your ideologies and your uh, life ke funde but it doesn't mean you're not cool it just means that they have had a different experience with something and therefore they have a different thought process towards it don't go in self doubt if you don't get the social acceptance you expected listen that again respect everyone accept yourself and try to stay with people who empower you and who motivate you to be a better person now the fourth and last point is mistakes and learnings now it's completely up to you about what you think about your college curriculum college activities and whatever you want to do in life after some point you realize which direction you want to go to and uh, it's a very personal choice about what you want to pursue do you want to go and study more do you want to uh, be the president of some college club or do you want to go and start your own business do you want to make youtube videos it just depends on you and it's your choice take the risk you are debating about business start karna hai karo youtube videos banane hai banao tumhe uh, linkedin pe post likhna hai ya fir apni agency start karni hai karo kya hoga log hasenge always remember that only those people laugh who don't have the courage to do the things themselves remember that and just listen to that again it's very very important in terms of professional life if i were to break it down to you very simply all you have to do is you have to explore every single um, career domain that you find interesting whichever one you like you have to pursue it further and you have to somehow make sure that you come in the top 1% of that domain now this can be something like a um, social media marketer it can be a coder it can also be something like uh, a startup founder so it's completely up to you and up to your decisions about what you want to pursue it's no one else's decision all of this sounds very fantasized and very easy but remember that this will take you months to figure out like i have a few people including myself who are about to enter third year but we are not really sure about what exactly we want to pursue and it's completely normal 
ऑलवेज रिमेंबर पॉइंट वन बाकी चिल करो इट्स अ बिग मोमेंट यू आर फाइनली गोइंग टू जॉइन कॉलेज यू आर एटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड दैट्स अ बिग डील राइट आई मीन यू आर बिकमिंग दैट अडल्ट यू ऑलवेज विश टू बिकम और मे बी डिड नॉट विश टू बिकम आई होप यू मेड नोट्स ऑफ ऑल द फोर पॉइंट्स दैट आई मैंशन स्टिक दैम ऑन योर हॉस्टल रूम वॉल और एनी प्लेस दैट यू यू नो see regularly apart from that come back to this video if you ever feel lost in college i think i have uh, narrowed it down uh, pretty nicely which works out for me as well uh, that's pretty much it for this video i hope you uh, enjoyed and you know learned something uh, subscribe to the channel if you uh, had fun and if you uh, got some insights and i'll see you in my next one peace and have fun in college